doesn't want to now. <laughs> Okay, I've got from S. So if you've got a surname with S M. or M, sorry, M. Oh, Mentus. Oh. Yep. What's your surname? I think that must be at the bottom of Mrs. Pile there. Oh, yeah. Any others from M onwards? M surname onwards. Margaret, what's your I think you're at the bottom of Mrs. Pyle there. Mm -hmm. Squires. Which one are you, sweetie? Sorry. Thank you. Sorry. What? <laughs> <laughs> I've never heard it said before. Zoe. Here we go. There you go, Zoe. Okay. Zoe. There you go. So how does it feel, guys? You're just about to find Horrible. out what you've got. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you. Go and see some happy faces. How is it? You looking a bit relieved? All good? Yeah, pass English. Pass English. <laughs> what does that mean for you now then? I don't know. You don't know? <laughs> He's the happiest man alive now. Distinction one. Oh, I don't understand. 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 I I Every last, I think that's last. I think that's every last. I'm all right. I'm the smartest kid. I don't know how I've managed to do that for English. So how well have you done then? What have you got? I've done pretty all right. You've done pretty all right. I passed. I've passed the things I need to pass, I and I've got the stuff I need for my own levels. About 12, so. 9 to 7 grades. That's pretty impressive. What does this mean for you now? Um, I can go on to my A levels, and it should be... Yeah, I should have enough to get into my things I need to do. And where are you heading off to? Exeter College. Exeter College, what are you going to be studying there? Uh, computer science, maths and physics. And just how important is it to get a good set of GCSE results going into the next phase of life? Um, well, it gets you into the next level of education, so I'd say it's fairly important. And of course, it's a, one last chance to come back together to Clumpton Community College, see all your friends before you head off. How important is it that everyone is here today to celebrate and um, just be with each other? It's all right. <laughs> it's all right. Brilliant. Well, well done. Well done.
So you're about to have the moment of truth. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yes. Guys, how's it feel? Yeah, pretty good. <laughs> oh, she's in tears already. How many minutes is it yet? You're all good. So guys, how well did you do? All good? Food food was the best one. What what does this mean for you now then? Do a college course that we wanted. Are you both heading to college together? Yeah. Where where are you heading to? And what you what are you gonna be doing? Sports science. And so what did you get? I got five in science, a six in food. I passed English language and I passed maths, and that's all I needed. I can clearly see you're quite emotional. Just how is it uh, bracing yourself for GCSE results day? God, it was stressful thinking about it. I tried to put it to the back of my mind, and then it got to the day, and that's when all the emotions just came through. But it's happy days, happy tears. And how are you going to be celebrating now? Working. <laughs> Working. Yeah. I guess it's nice to all be together as well, one last time. Yep, yep. Very much so. Going to see some of the teachers and thank them, and then oh, yeah. that's it. I, I don't know where they all are. Just get a picture of that, so I get it. Um, and how about yourself? How is it for you? <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm pretty happy actually. Yeah, and yeah. you're off to college as well to Exeter to do yeah. sports science. Yeah, no, oh. no, uh, A levels. A levels. Yeah. What, what are you going to be doing then? PE, uh, psychology, and health and social care. And a good set of results. Just what yeah. you wanted. Yeah. Oh. You look happy. Yeah. All good over here. Yeah. What What have you got? What have you done? Um, I got five maths. And that was the important thing. Yeah. Because sometimes it comes down to one subject, doesn't it? Really. So what does this mean for you then? Um, I'll be able to do college course. Brilliant. Well, well done. Get a picture of you two together. Look, looking happy. Pictures. Lovely. So are we going to go and pick him up, are we? This is where we go. How is it feel? Are the butterflies in the stomach going? A little bit, a little bit, yeah. 
Right let's, let's go and find out what the result is. Fair play. Is that, <laughs> is, that, is that an understatement or...? Uh, thank you. Oh, no. Fantastic. He beat me. He beat you. <laughs> 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 So, how is it? What have you done? <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> also, P2. Passed, you got passed. Yeah. Passed everything. Yeah. That, that sounds promising. Oh, you did get a seat. Did you get the Adam? Uh, Nine, nine in history. That's pretty impressive. Eight in. Six is B. Six is B. So you've got one, two, three, four, five. Five B's. Three A's. Three sevens. Yeah. That's three A's. Two A's. What does this mean for you then? And just how pleased are you? Really pleased, yeah. What will you be heading off to do now? A levels, biology, psychology, and PA. And where will you be doing that? Excellent. Looking forward to it, the next step? Yeah, yeah. Just how important is it to get these GCSE results in the bag as you head on? Uh, I think it's pretty important. But I think if you don't do really well, it's not like the end of the world. Because, obviously, I don't know, you can still like recover from it. Yeah. Are you really pleased with what yeah. you yeah. And who have you got here? Teacher? Mother? <laughs> Mum, how is it? Proud yeah, mum this yeah, morning? He's fantastic, isn't he? So he worked really hard, so he deserves what he's got. Yeah, he's, he's done really well. Really proud of him. Yeah. Oh. Is that one mark off? Yeah. That's for you. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Over there, we'll go over here and see what's going on. So what have we got going on over here? So, just how well have you done? What What's the lowdown? Um, so we've got double A in science, B in French, A star in history, uh, B, C in stats, A star in food prep, A star in English language, A in English lit, A in RE, A in maths and an A in geography. That's a lot of A's there. Just how <laughs> pleased are you? Very pleased. And what does this mean for you now? Um, I don't know. Going to college and hopefully getting a good, uh, keep working at the level that I am. And uh, where are you heading to college and what are you going to be studying there? Um, I'm going to Exeter and I'm doing English Lit, Psychology and Geography. And just how important is it to get a good set of GCSE results heading into college? Quite important. <laughs> I just, yeah, I had expectations and they've been met, so... And yeah. having expectations going into the day itself, just how have you been feeling throughout the summer since exams? Do you think they went all right? Are they better than expected? Or um, Yeah, I think they went okay, but I wasn't expecting such high ones for maths and everything. And of course, it looks like you brought your family along this morning. Just yeah. Nice way to celebrate, bring, yeah. bring them along there for support. How important is it to have a good family behind you when, you, when it comes really to GCSE? Important.
I'm thinking of career wise, have you got any plan in action or are you just going to see where life takes you? I do, well, well done, well done. Oh, happy birthday to you. Yes. <laughs> right, hold those results up so we can see. Uh, there we are. And so we've got more happy spaces over here. How are you this morning? All right. Yeah? That's a beaming smile. Is that good news? And what does that mean for you then? That you've got everything you need to go to the next stage? Uh, I've got everything to get to the next to what I really mostly wanted to do. And that's the important thing, I guess. Yeah. How about you? Yeah, good. Yeah, all good as well. I think everybody As a member of staff, how are you finding it? Oh, it's wonderful. It's just so exciting to see all of our students getting the, the results that they deserve after all their hard work. And it's yeah. brilliant to be able to celebrate today so that they're ready to go on to the next stage. And we wish them well for that. It's it must be nice to see everyone coming together as well. One last time to say yeah. goodbye to Year 11s. One last time to say goodbye. But they do, they're quite good at keeping in touch. We've got a really good alumni association, so they do come back and inspire the next generation. Brilliant. one more but this time you're going to hold them up in the air and celebrate where are you off to come back come back in the photograph right so hold them all up in the air and if, if, and after three you're going to have a big shout and a big cheer so after three one two three lovely so mrs Phelan, how is gcse results day for clumpton community college this year give us the rundown it's, it's a lovely day and a lovely feeling yeah it's really nice to be able to celebrate with the students and uh, and see their pleasure after all that hard work because it's it's really difficult now the, the, the demands are so much higher it's all exam based um top of questions um, and to you know to get the kind of results that they do is is just amazing and really pleased for them so we've got um um, I think sort of 70 plus percent in terms of uh, 9 to 4s and then up in the 50s and 60s on the 9 to 5. Got a high proportion of the 9 to 7 grades and I know it doesn't necessarily mean everything to you know, the, um, the public but for the kids you know they really understand that that's giving them the next step in their education that's what it's all about. So it's, it's about the pleasure of today and sharing that with their friends but also just being able to, to move on to their post-16 courses. And just how nice is it to see everyone come together, teachers, staff, yeah. former pupils now? It's really, really lovely because the last time we saw them was um, for the prop end of July and it was sort of you know see you on results day and I think there's always that sense of trepidation for students what it's going to be like it's lovely to get back together and, and yeah see their friends and, and then launch them really 
to ask the next yeah. Of course, we talk about the exam stress for students, yeah. but how is it for pupil, uh, for members of staff? Yeah, just as nail biting. It's really important for us because we know everybody individually and we know how hard they've worked and all the extra time that they put into it. So it's just as important for taking our personal interest. So, yeah, it's important day for us too. And of course, in a couple of weeks, we get to start all over again with a new set of year sevens, a new set of year tens going into GCSEs. What yeah. advice would you have for all those who are about to embark on their exams and school life? I think the most important thing is that you know approach it with a positive attitude and then enjoy school and enjoy every aspect of it. And that's what we want. But it does make a difference if you put in the work you do get the results and you know the evidence is there that if you, you make the effort um, and you put in that hard work you can get what you want. Fantastic. Right. Thank you very much. Enjoy the rest of the day. There we go. So there we are. That is GCSE results day at Clumpton Community College. Things quieting down now, but obviously all the happy faces still here celebrating the day. And you can keep up with all the other GCSE results from schools across the county on the Devon Live live blog. So from me, Lewis Clark, here at Clumpton Community College. If it's your GCSE results day, I hope you got what you wanted. And we will bid you adieu.